Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. We're Dos Cavazos, and today we are watching the second episode of season three of The Umbrella Academy. The last episode was a really good start to the season. We officially got introduced to the Sparrow Academy, um, like we learned all their names and whatnot. Um, Don't remember them all. Just yeah, <laughs> we'll, we'll have to see them a few more times, but it looks like we already lost Marcus yeah. already. <laughs> I don't know what this little ball of fire is. Yeah. Um, obviously, their mother thinks that it's some sort of thing sent from God, but it's killing people and pugs, and I don't know. I feel like it's just gaining strength. Yeah. Now, what does that really mean? Is it like, and I feel like it's an entity, you know? I feel like it's a person, or not a person, but like some sentient thing that's accumulating strength in some capacity. That would be my first guess. Obviously, it hasn't really gave us enough to go off of just yet, but that's just where my mind's going. A lot of other stuff happened too. We found out Diego has a child with Lila. It's 12 years old. I'm assuming she's just been time hopping for yeah. 12 years, and now she dumped him on Diego. So now we have the possibility of them potentially running into their kind of alternate versions of themselves mm -hmm. in this timeline. They say they're going to avoid them, but I feel like that's not going to happen. I feel like they're going to end up running yeah. into at least to somebody, one of them. Maybe not all of their doppelgangers, but at least one or two or three or who knows. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like we're going to end up running into all of them, to be honest. And, you know, we brought up the question in the last episode uh, about Allison's child. Whether this child is actually alive was a big question for us. And if this child is alive, she might already have her mom. So yeah. that might be a and whole thing like in and of the, itself. The other Allison is like her mom, mm -hmm. you know, which like... That's just like so crazy to think about yeah. because if she never got into the Umbrella Academy, who knows if her life, like, if she would have still, you know, had her child mm. or whatnot. I don't know. I guess that's going to be really interesting to see. I also thought it was interesting to see what the Sparrow Academy developed into after, like, staying together, unlike what happened to the Umbrella Academy. It almost kind of makes you wonder, is like, would this be what the Umbrella Academy would have become if they all stayed together yeah. here in, like, I guess the original timeline? But at some point in time, I feel like we're just going to have to go back in time and fix the issue, and the, the issue being, like, their father adopting the I wasn't going to say the right children, but the original children yeah. and starting the umbrella, the umbrella Academy because them being here is, I think, the reason why this little ball of fire is here in the basement in the first place. Obviously, they're in the search of the briefcase. I feel I feel like the mother hid it somewhere. I don't know if she actually even knows what it is. She might have just like been cleaning up. And it was like, like oh, who this left this basement? briefcase? Yeah. yeah, this is a good place for it. Yeah. So I feel like what's going to happen now is what's left of the Sparrow Academy is probably going to think that the Umbrella Academy took out Marcus. And maybe that is going to be what's going to kind of spark them to like pursue them even further. They obviously were spying on him and they saw him there with Vanya. So based off of what happened to them when they all ganged up on Vanya, I don't think it would be out of their realm of possibility to think that she killed Marcus. And yeah. maybe that's what's going to spark like their next uh, fight. All right, well, if you haven't already, don't forget to like and subscribe and check out our Patreon if you want to see our full-length reaction to the series. We also do have a second channel, Dos Cavazos IRL, where we do vlogs and other non reaction to content. And if you want to check that out, links down below. All right, let's jump into this episode. Hotel. Hotel Obsidian. Oh, he opened it. Mm. <laughs> Good morning. Oh, he just misses his dog. Can't decide. <laughs> it's too loud or not. Aww. Aww. Penny crumb. <laughs> <laughs> Not weird? Are you noticing? Are you remembering? You were just attacked by birds yesterday, presumably. Yeah. <laughs> the cube. cube! Isn't it Christopher, right? <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh no! Hello there, stranger. Just going on a jog. Mm -hmm. <laughs> They're gonna be like, where's Marcus? Mm -hmm. Ask the ball in your basement. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, oh, the sparrow and sparrow. the umbrella. Oh, uh, she's gonna find out. Oh, I'm here about the time the Umbrella Academy defeated the robbers at the museum. Again? Does she actually live here? Is her daughter born? Mm -hmm. All these questions. Or is she just like breaking into a house? <laughs> oh, if 
feel like I'm getting nervous that it's like not gonna just be so simple. Yeah, I don't feel like it's, it's gonna, gonna be, be sad. Claire, it's mommy. Mommy. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh no. What's going on? Oh. oh. Where, where, where's my baby? You have ten seconds to leave. Where is Claire? Lady, there's no Claire here. Ah, uh, yeah. So he was with someone else, yeah. you know, not her. Because you probably would never have met him right? Never. if you weren't brought into the Umbrella Academy. Something is very wrong. Oh. We're here, Hotel Obsidian. That's sad. Mm. I felt like something was weird with that. Yeah. I'm still looking for the dog. Kennedy, Kennedy six. six. Oh, like they're in the history yeah. books. Sissy. Sissy Cooper. The greatest gift of a lifetime. You let me feel alive for the first time. That's a wonderful thing. They wouldn't still be. She wouldn't be alive. This There's is the no 60s. Way, yeah. so, but the son, that was what we speculated. Yeah. You know, because this guy. What was the name again on the briefcase? I forgot already. Pocket. Pocket. Is that drugs? <laughs> Wait, no, it's like a note. So, uh, I, uh, I talked to Marcus last night. Wait, what? You talked with the enemy? By yourself? <laughs> the enemy? Who elected you, Vanya? It's, uh, Victor. Who's Victor? I am. It's who I've always been. Is that an issue for anyone? <laughs> no, I'm good with it. Yeah, me too. <laughs> cool. Truly happy for you, Victor. Well, last time I checked, you don't speak for this family. We made a deal. He's gonna give back Five's briefcase, and then we're gonna get out of the timeline. Wait till y'all find out about the ball. <laughs> I will get the briefcase, and then we will all go back and fix the timeline. This is a perfectly acceptable time. Yeah, why don't you go tell that to Allison, who's upstairs grieving her daughter who doesn't even exist here? Not to mention, we've been replaced by a bunch of blobs and cubes and birds. <laughs> Take a look around. If you hadn't noticed, there's no doomsday. There's no apocalypse. Mm -hmm. It's formulating in the mm -hmm. basement. <laughs> there's always an apocalypse with y'all. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, what's it doing now? Is it taking more people? It really is like looking, I feel like. It's only going a little bit past this hotel, though. We need to get out of here. Get some fresh air. You said you're retired, and that's what retired people do. And don't you deserve some fun? Like there's no lobsters. It took the lobsters. Oh. Oh, the ball took the lobsters? Yeah. Why did it take the weirdest things? I mean, <laughs> like a pug. Like the weirdest combination <laughs> yeah. of things. It's like Marcus, a pug mix, and three lobsters. Yeah. <laughs> Don stuffed three mini muffins down his pants. And this is oh. a buffet. I can take whatever the hell I want. <laughs> <laughs> My father was a Hall of Fame asshole. And when I was just a little piss hand like you, I made a promise to myself that I would never act like him to any kid of mine. Yeah, stop. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> <laughs> Put a lot on my shoulders, okay? So I'm not gonna let you slow me down either, all right? Yeah, you look really busy right now. Oh! Mm -hmm. What? Your ears leaking. Uh, is that like wax? I forgot to pack my ear medicine. Oh. 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 Ear medicine, huh? If I don't okay. drain it, uh, pus leaks on me. It smells like cat puke. Oh. We have tubes. Road sodas for the journey. I mean, sometimes guys, wait, where are you going? Oh, they're splitting. That, that, yeah, it, it always gets happens, bad yeah. when they split up. Do they take Luther back here? Yeah. Oh, is this the girl? I forgot her name already. Oh, where am I? The Academy, silly. Everybody's waiting for you. The Academy. He's gonna think that he's like, like normal. Not normal, but like back where he mm -hmm. should be. You must be starving. Oh, uh, no, I, I, I probably shouldn't. So why are you treating him nice now? You know, uh, now that you mention it, I am feeling a little bit uh, peckish, actually. Prop yourself. <laughs> okay, they're being really nice. Yeah, but why? Aww. Excellent juice. I feel like they're trying to find Marcus. 
Yeah, they're up to something. I'm Ben, number two. It is so good to see you again, buddy. <laughs> Why does everyone keep looking at me like that? Because you've been dead for 15 years. Dead? What do you mean, dead? <laughs> it's kind of confusing. In our universe. <laughs> number three. Alfonso. Quattro. Sloan. <laughs> hey. Hey. I'm Jamie. Sex. That's Christopher, of course. Number seven. <laughs> can, can we explain Christopher? <laughs> Whatever game the Umbrellas are playing, you're gonna lose. You took our number one, so we took you. Wait. <laughs> oh, he's like hostage? Yeah. It does not sound like Vanya to go and kidnap anybody. <laughs> you know, having said that, I am usually the last to know about these kind of things. <laughs> Discipline has never really been our strong suit. Much free for all over there. <laughs> <laughs> Don't have y'all's organization. If they have your guy, I'll make sure to send him back without a scratch. All right, no harm, no foul. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. They're not gonna let you go. Come on, what? Stupid briefcase. Uh oh, oh shit. You need to put gas in it? Like, <laughs> is what? Recharge it? That's not oh. a good idea. <laughs> Watch it work. I. Oh. <laughs> You're about to break it. Oh my gosh! Yeah, what if you could just repair it? Work. You could just like blow on it like the video games back in the day. We are going to Pennsylvania to find my birth mother. Yeah. Oh. Just needed somebody to come with me for emotional support. Oh, <laughs> emotional support. Yeah. Like schnauz it's supposed to be my retirement. <laughs> I'm supposed to be retired. Yeah, I know. Mm -hmm. I know. It's supposed to be a carefree road trip. Well, it still can be, babe. Ball of twine. Plus time. That's like the title is the <laughs> yeah. biggest ball of twine. Yes. Oh, they're gonna crash. Oh my god. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> ball of twine. I found a treasure trove of our family history. You paid three thousand dollars. I was too messed up to uh, do anything about it, too scared to look her up. But always in the back of my mind, I wondered why she sold me off for three grand. I mean, come on, she couldn't have held out for five, six. <laughs> oh, no. But what is family? What is it? It's like some kind of giant ball of twine. twine. <laughs> and the older you get, the bigger it gets, and the more you I try and untangle it, the more and more. They're just like talking <laughs> over each other. Y'all yeah. listening to each other? Have you tried that on it? No, yet? because my ears don't squirt juice every time I get excited. Jamie, get me munchies. No, oh, he's gonna try something. We don't or he's gonna you. overhear that they have Luther. <laughs> <laughs> don't worry, I got your back. Oh my gosh. Watch well, him be able to like. I wonder, you. can like the kid of someone with two people that parents that have powers yeah. maybe have powers oh. as well? Because you're a superhero doesn't mean you have to be a dick. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Are you gonna pay for that? You're acting like the seven right now. Yeah. <laughs> well, isn't this a kawinky dick? Only thing I see is yours, tough guy. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh or I'm gonna spank you like the little bitch you are. Take your best shot, Tubby. Oh, can he not? Can he only like take damage? I don't know. Maybe not. Oh no! <laughs> don't hit him. Doesn't feel good, does it? Don't do it, no. So like how can you like like go against him? him yeah. You know? It's a very um interesting, interesting power, yeah. All that milk! Clean up on aisle whatever. She's eating candy. Let's see. Does the sun have powers? When will you say yes to me? <laughs> That'd be cool if the sun had powers like Lila. Oh. <laughs> Is it only his face that does it? I don't know. See that? Is that what a was piece that? of him? Your chin. <laughs> does that sometimes. What? It just <laughs> falls off? He got hit there, yeah. so. 
Oh shit! Oh, oh. oh you know it's. Oh, but yeah. it get, okay. I guess he was just like holding it in. And now this works, yeah. That's my kid, asshole. Oh. <laughs> oh, now you claim him. <laughs> oh, you getting tired now? The car's getting weaker. Not even close. What's that? Oh, does he have asthma? Stop crying, right? Yeah, spit. Or venom. That's where it comes out of. Oh, yeah, it's like oh. venom. Block it this time. She got you last time. Don't let her do it again. No. Oh, oh. yeah. Nice reflexes. I'm gonna work on you, dude. <laughs> I can handle my own shit. <laughs> <laughs> Like, okay, Did I you get your you. ear stuff? <laughs> okay, look at him maturing from having a child. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, they did like get in the fight together. <laughs> yeah. So at least we know the other guy's weakness, though. Mm -hmm. He just doesn't have a lot of stamina, I guess. Wait, is this? She's Amish. Like his mom? Hmm. Amish. This explains everything. How does this explain anything? Because look. So does that mean he's here too? Oh, like his. Like he may have just like, like stayed Amish here, class? yeah. This one you gotta do alone. <sighs> alone? <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah, I can do that, sure. Guten Abend. Is that her? Or no, it's just a rabbit. <laughs> well, you happen to know where I might find her? I'm trying to track her down. Said, she said, no Rachel here. Now, mm. walk your fancy boots back to town where you belong and leave us be. Okay. They obviously okay. know her. You need to get your knickers in a twist there. Tell him, let the boy speak. That's her, right? Hmm. I feel like it might be. I always wanted the Umbrella Academy to be like this. Now you guys actually do stuff together. You don't? Uh. Kind of fell apart. <laughs> <laughs> You're actually really sweet. Spark's gonna start flying. Mm. Who's watching? Oh. This is their dad. One day. I want to see them all. You know, I, uh, I spend a little time on the moon. <laughs> oh the my, moon? Oh my god, no one ever thinks that's cool. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the moon. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> 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 oh, oh. Oh, it's turning back. Where are you guys staying anyway? Oh, just some dumpy hotel down. Uh, oh. Maybe she was just. Like playing nice. No, of course. Luther, he's so stupid. Oh wow, you really I don't know. She was giving him she... faces before. But then she like saw oh, him but... looking yeah. and then like <laughs> my birds are watching. Mm -hmm. yeah. They're always watching. <laughs> hmm. Why is she looking at them? Oh, she's using oh, the powers. Her power. Yeah. Okay, who are we going after now? The cows. Yeah, the cows. Right? Because maybe you don't notice it. It's got to be cows. It's not five. Oh, oh yeah! Oh my gosh! Notice no! this! <laughs> okay. You see that they're all gone. And because he noticed the lobsters. Okay. Oh, can't I get one fucking day off? <laughs> Is she bringing in food? I guess so. Like I like cow, lobster, and pug. <laughs> you know Rachel. She's my sister. Oh. oh. <laughs> you think they made her leave because she like had a kid? Yeah, and they maybe thought, she's like, like okay, she's yeah. had a kid, you know, and got pregnant. So, uh, how did she die? Brain hemorrhage. Oh. Took her quick. Thank the Lord. What about her son? What son? Wait, <gasps> when did she die? That doesn't make any yeah. sense. It's her. 1989. 89. Oh. Or does he not have the double date? No, it's just it's, it's my. It's my birthday. Oh, she died in giving birth, maybe. There's a part of me that still feels like that could be her. Maybe she's just lying. I don't know. There you go. Bye. I'm just trying to figure out. Was he doing that? Oh right. no! Is he gonna be like chased by all the Amish? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh 
Oh my oh god! My gosh. Klaus always gets in the craziest like uh, situations. Yeah. Start the car! Start the car! Wrong with people! I, I really, I did. I tried. Wait! 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 wait, wait, wait. I feel like it was the sister. And, and she wasn't the only one? Come on! Oh. Come on, Klaus! You have our eyes. English. How's it go? Okay, oh. so definitely the sister. Not lying about it. She wasn't the only one. Mm -hmm. So think in the community, the though? Huh. Because... My mom died here before I was even born. Okay. So were they not what? even born in what this did universe? you just say? Did them coming here like cancel out their like their other existence here, you know? Let's see. Well, that's just Klaus. We'll see if it's like the other ones too. Oh. Oh, that's weird. That's what are you why? Don't let your kind in here. What did you say? What? Oh, is she having like Oh, like flashbacks? PTSD. Yeah. I'll be back. Allison, are you okay? One more swing. Oh, she's going through like a lot, a mm -hmm. lot. Allison, come on, what is happening? Where is Claire? It's great. Where are you going? Oh, there's a guy. Allison? Just disappeared. Are you okay? Powers? Powers! Okay, that's oh, it's him. Like that's the freezy. kid. Like, it's like frosty. It's gotta be the kid. Screaming. I was kicking well, his ass. You couldn't breathe, but... It doesn't look <laughs> like your family is coming anytime soon. Oh, no, I'm sure they're just, you know, working out the final details and <laughs> such. So where's their dad right now? <laughs> During all this. And I promise we won't be so hospitable next time. Super don't like being threatened, Ben. You'll do as we say, or else. Go. <laughs> My brain. <laughs> Got. Don't forget your tote bag. <gasps> oh. I thought it was going to be the briefcase for a second. I don't know why I thought that. Hope you enjoyed your stay. <laughs> they gave him, like, a little, like, goodie bag. <laughs> Oh. oh wait, are you gonna finally see? Oh, the briefcase. Yeah. But, I mean, y'all don't know how to work that. Oh, no. Oh, okay. Okay, she's Miles using the using power. Yeah. Okay, but now she has the but now briefcase. Now she has their briefcase. I kinda need that, so. I'll go too far. And don't break it like you did the last one. <laughs> Dumping Stan on me after all these years? I mean, that's that's not right. <laughs> hey man, if you did the deed, don't blame her for the consequences. That's, that's not the point. Oh, what's the point? He's cramping my style. <laughs> <laughs> to danger on a moment's notice. Where is he? How am I supposed Speaking to do that of... when I'm playing wet nurse to a 12 year old? You're his dad. Alleged dad. <laughs> Aw. Don't be like how your dad was with y'all. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Okay, gather around, people. Where is, where's every, where's Luther? I haven't seen him. No. Are y'all just now realizing? <laughs> I'm just worried okay. about right now. Like what? Not Luther? <laughs> Bigger problems. Who are they? These are our mothers. Oh. They all died. They, every single one of them died? That one's mine. Oh. <laughs> Died on the exact same day, October 1st, 1989. It's our birthday. Not anymore, it isn't. They all died before we were born. That's okay. crazy. When we jumped here, we created a time paradox. Oh. Not just any paradox, but this is the grandfather paradox. What the hell is a grandfather paradox? What does that mean? Bye. Well, I mean, I'm assuming it's going to cause the end of the world. Yeah. <laughs> and it's be this ball. <laughs> They, like, made themselves never even born, somehow. Is that Sloan? I don't know why that's funny to me. I like this song. <laughs> I think it's funny because he's, like, so big. Yeah. 
We're being watched. What? By mm. who? My family. They're crazy. But I want to let you know I meant every word I said. Even about the moon? <laughs> <laughs> Is anyone watching us now? No. But I mean, you should be. Oh! oh. Luther made the move. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so as the Umbrella Academy always does, they get themselves in a situation which seems like it's going to end up causing the end of the world. Mm -hmm. um, Five described it as the grandfather paradox. Uh, we found out that all their mothers died the day that they were supposed to have these kids. So it's interesting now. I wonder what, I mean, obviously this ball is here because they are, and it's taking in just living creatures. I'm assuming getting stronger, but I don't really understand like why it's picking who it's picking, you know? Because it seems like it's going as far as they are because it got right up to where five was and before that, it was going right to the hotel and that's where they were as well. So it kind of seems like it's only like perimeter maybe is just as far away from it as they are, at least in my opinion. So Vanya is also Victor now. It seems like the whole situation with Sissy kind of inspired him to be his true self, mm -hmm. who he always was. And then also with that being said as well, we saw the pocket, <laughs> the pocket, <laughs> what's the same pocket again? Yeah. I think that that's Harlan. Sissy's son. Yeah, yeah, Harlan. I don't know. It was some sort of freezy power though. Yeah, but I mean, we weren't quite exactly yeah. Sure, the I mean, it looked like it had the same power as Victor, but now I mean, could it have developed? Could it have changed? Also, Lila has the last briefcase mm -hmm. here. I don't necessarily know if I trust her with it though, because she just destroyed the last one. <laughs> uh, <laughs> just like fucking worked, you just started hitting it against like, the dang. park bench. It's like when you like kick something like your electronic that doesn't work. Yeah. yeah, also, Luther looks like he's having a little bit of a romance mm -hmm. right now with Sloan. I feel like it's well deserved. I feel yeah. like. The whole thing between him and Allison might never work out because it always right. seems like there's something going on with Allison. And I feel like it's nice to him to have like a romantic interest. You know, and Allison, I mean, obviously the first husband like was like another thing, but her second husband too, I feel like, you know, that's going to take a lot for her to get over mm -hmm. because she still loves him. And it's not like, you know, like she just left him like t a few <laughs> Yesterday. Days ago, you know? <laughs> yeah. And um, I mean, and then now the thing with her daughter, like that's yeah. like, she's that got takes a precedence. lot, a lot going on. So yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I so, feel bad. I feel bad for her too. I wonder what Victor was gonna trade Marcus too, because it seemed like there was gonna be like this trade yeah. that was like facilitated between them. And I don't, I don't know, really like, know. What could it have been? Information? Well, no, that it like would have been information. Yeah, like, I thought it was gonna be something physical, but I guess not. Yeah, I have no idea. Or maybe it was just like a tactic to like get the briefcase back. Yeah, I guess. Regardless, they gotta figure out about the freaking ball in the basement. Yeah. I mean, eventually, I you you would think that somebody would have been like, why does mom keep going? Down to the basement, <laughs> yeah, but, you know. why should you bring cookies guess, and who's she bringing them to? <laughs> I guess no, they have other priorities right yeah. now with the Umbrella Academy out. But I mean, I kind of put that on the Sparrow Academy yeah. right now. I mean, it is in their house, so you would imagine that they'd find something in the basement. But also, their father, what's up with him? He why just, is it like stays watching in his TV? Room. Yeah. yeah, it seems like you know he achieved his goal of having like the superhero team, and now he's just letting them do whatever they're doing. And now he's, I guess, relaxing. Yeah. Are we ever going to get back to the fact that? he's an alien too are his yeah. children gonna find that out i don't know i also really like diego and his son yeah i don't know there it's it's kind of cute to see him like assume this role of a father like overnight yeah <laughs> um but i feel like he's doing like actually a pretty good job i mean mm -hmm. like he obviously doesn't know how to be a father and i feel like we're gonna see him kind of learn and grow along the way um yeah. and then also we kind of speculated like what if the son does have powers yeah i feel like if he did he probably would have done it there when they were fighting yeah. but like also i don't fully know either so yeah i feel like that would be a really cool thing if he did obviously that's mm -hmm. not something that we've like really touched on you yeah. know can two people with powers have a child and that person have powers or was it just you know the people that were born on this date also it kind of makes me wonder if they're not supposed to be here like is it a situation 
kind of like in Back to the Future. You remember how they're like getting erased from mm-hmm. time eventually? I wonder if there's like a time clock on themselves as well. I don't really understand the grandfather theory. I mean, that probably makes the most sense because it's mm-hmm. like if it, it's it's almost like if you think about it in terms of like you know, you messed up this timeline, it's gonna do whatever it needs to to correct itself or whatever, you know? So hopefully we get some more information from Five about what the grandfather paradox truly means. All right, well, thank you so much for watching, and if you haven't already, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell so you can stay notified for our future videos. And also head over to our Patreon if you wanna watch our full-length reaction to the series. We upload them over there. The link's down in the description below. Okay, we'll see you next time. Bye, everyone.